Uh, All right, have you ever wondered what is the best Aventus style fragrance? Well, stick around, I'm gonna cover three amazing options. So back when I first started collecting, everyone was talking about this fragrance. This is called Club Denoui Intense Man. This, for those of you that don't know, is an Aventus style fragrance. And Aventus is one of the highest selling fragrances, especially for the niche fragrances, from Creed, the House of Creed. This smells spot on. Now the thing about this fragrance, when it first came out, clone fragrances or fragrances that dupe other fragrances were not very good. So you'd smell them, you go, ah, I mean, yeah, it kind of smells like that. I can see where you think it smells like that, but it has this horrible smell. This was the first fragrance that really was like, hold on, that smells like a Ventus. Like, not just close, that, that's in the air, it smells like a Ventus. Now, the downside about this fragrance, so this is the EDT, this is the original version, it has like a harsh lemon cleaner opening. So after the, the first 30 minutes, it dries down to a beautiful Aventus style fragrance. I absolutely love it, but those first 30 minutes are a little rough, kind of like red tobacco from Mancera. The thing about this though, it used to be super affordable. Now I'm seeing it for like 50 bucks online, which I would never pay 50 bucks for this fragrance. I don't think it's worth it at all. But if you wanna get close to Aventus, this was always your go-to. Now, the one that I've always recommended though was this right here. This is Mont Blanc Explorer. So for those who don't know, the House of Parfums de Marly, they will take designer fragrances and then basically make the niche version of it. So they'll make it more rich, more royal, more luxurious, just smell better. Percival is their Abercrombie Fitz Fierce. Um, Godolphin is their Tuscan Leather. They have other ones that smell like other fragrances. Well. This is the opposite. This is a designer house taking a niche fragrance and making the designer version of it. And I've always preferred this one over Club de Nuit Intense Man. I think this is much better, smells better, smells incredible, great DNA. Performance is the one drawback. I wish it lasted longer, but you know what, what you're getting, you just get that beautiful DNA. Absolutely love it. So this has always been, and I say always, for a long time, anyone says, what is the best of Vince's fragrance? I'll say, Skip Club de Nuit, get this instead. For those of you who know, this is Nitro Black. Nitro Black is, I don't know if you can tell based off the coloration, this is an Aventus style fragrance. Holy cow, this is good. This is really good. And unlike Club de Nuit Intense Man, this costs only $30. It's really affordable online. I love the DNA, I love the scent, performance, projection, atomizers, really good. This is just Aventus. Like it smells like Aventus. Now, I will say I'm not getting like heavy pineapple with this. I get pineapple, but it isn't super heavy. Uh, and again, I don't even know pineapple is listed as a note, but you kind of get that sweetness that Aventus is known for with that pineapple. I think this is the winner. If I'm being totally honest. Now, yes, just spoiler, there was a uh, fragrance discounter that sent me this called perfumebox.com. Yes, I was sent this fragrance. I just want to make that clear. The other two I bought, this one I was sent. I do not get any kickback from that place. Um, yes, they sent me fragrances, but uh, by saying I like this fragrance and saying, hey, if you go here, that's where I got it from, I will not get a kickback. It's not like they're gonna give me 10% of every purchase. So I just wanna make that very clear. I'm not sponsored with this at all. But dang, this is a killer, killer, killer fragrance. This is phenomenal. And for those of you that have followed the channel lately, I keep saying over and over, I'm over the Aventus DNA. It just bores me, I don't like it anymore, I don't wear it anymore. When I smelled this the first time, I went, holy cow, I wanna wear it. And then I wore it and it was a great wear. I really enjoyed it, it smelled phenomenal on my skin. I really enjoyed it. So maybe I'm coming back around to like an Aventus again, I don't know. This is a great fragrance, highly recommend it. Of the three, I'd buy this first, then the Mont Blanc, and then honestly, I don't know why you would need Club de Nuit at that point. I know some people say they get crazy, like 12 hours performance, tons of compliments. If that's you, cool, wear it. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm not saying not to get it. I'm just saying personally, if I had to go back in time, this would be the first one I buy. I think Nitro Black is the winner of the three. As always, please comment down below. I love reading your comments. I love interacting with anybody that's watching these videos. Just, it, this is a community. We're here to help everybody get better at their fragrances, their collection, when to wear what, how to wear, all that good jazz. So love reading your comments down below. And thank you so much for subscribing. If you haven't, please, click the button below, subscribe, and then tap that bell notification just to make sure you don't miss any videos in the future. I try to upload every single day. So thank you so much for watching. And again, if you're curious, this is an amazing video. I highly recommend you watch it. Uh, it's the best summer fragrances out, I think, right now. So can't wait to talk to you in the future. This is Nubs Fragrance. Have a great day.